This is uh, Brad Haslam on my media uh, portfolio evaluation. I think that in the time between the preliminary task and the final project, I think I've learned a lot in terms of the way I work. Um, time management is one of the key things. Um, getting things done uh, in time and not last minute like this is. But my project wasn't. Not really. But yeah, I've learned a lot about time management. Um, what have I got? Uh, re my research in my work. Um, I've realised and learned that it's a lot more detailed, and uh, you need to. It's not as simple as everything looks. Uh, and it's quite actually quite hard making the magazine look professional and real. Um, some pr people probably think, and I thought it was easy. Uh, but it's not at all, um, and it takes a lot of skill and uh, talent, I think, to kind of produce a magazine cover uh, as good as the ones uh, our unit has produced and I have produced. So uh, I've learned a lot about software uh, in the last post, in the last video post. Um, I talked about technology, um, but I have learned uh, at the beginning of this uh, course. I didn't know a lot about. I did know a lot about Photoshop, but not the version we were using. Uh, it was Photoshop Elements 5, uh, but by now I know I have to use it uh, quite uh, in depth, so that's that's really good. Um, Quark Express, I knew absolutely nothing about. Uh, I didn't have a clue, uh, but I've learned how to use it, and it's a uh, it's a good uh, piece of software to use. Um, for, for your double page spread. There is also the blogs and all the tech, like internet stuff, uh, through Google, and I didn't really know how to do all that, um, but now I do. And uh, that's given me a, a lot of knowledge uh, into what, um, how the course kind of develops and things like that. And yeah, and just basically like details to um, details to uh, the magazine cover because I think people look at magazines and just think, oh, it's it's good, but it's a lot of de there's a lot of detail. Like you've got to there's a lot more in the cover than there seems to be. I think there's a lot more behind it because. Um, You've got to think about your target audience. You've got to think about, you know, your um, if it's going to sell well, uh, what institution you're going to obviously let uh, distribute your magazine, uh, your font, your color, house colors, and house design, um, things like that. So it is a lot more detail than I thought it was going to be. Uh, and after the um, well, after the realization and. Um, I think I did put more work in and uh, got to terms with what I was dealing with, so that was good. And I think I produced um, a really good project. So um, yeah, thank you.